Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone is doing okay today. Yes, so today's vlog we'll talk about Christmas Eve boxes, some ideas to put in your little one's Christmas Eve box and I'll show you what we've actually put in the boys. I think we've actually finished the boys Christmas Eve box now, not unless there's some running about. We thought, oh that'd be good, that'd be good. So this is what I do now this time of year when I'm out shopping. It'd be like, oh, if I see something it'd be Oh, I know, we'll put that for the boys or something like that. So I think we'll definitely finish the boys um, Christmas shopping wise. Obviously, with it being Ben's birthday as well, we're looking for birthday bits and pieces for him. So like I said, like we mentioned before in our previous vlogs on our main channel, this time last year, Ben wasn't very well. So it's lovely to see him loving all the lights and decorations and things. He absolutely loved the Warwick Castle, like, um parade yesterday well, i can't say it was a parade it's a trail actually to be honest if you really really love that great if you could be back again because it was so so cold yesterday really really was looked at del pre abbey near us as well and had that sort of sold out no blame and palace i've got one so we're gonna have to see what there is available but it's like seems so i don't want to book anything we've got to pay for it especially with the c word cases rise again here like crazy so uh, i think it's just one of those things where we just have to Go over the spare at the moment, I think. So, anyway, yep. So, anyway, let's get back on today's vlog with the Christmas Eve boxes, right? If I just grab them all out and I'll show you what I've actually got for each of them, they're more or less exactly the same, just in different sizes and different sort of things, right? So, first thing I've got for the boys is got them a pair of pajamas. Again, I've got Ben extra large, got the long sleeves as well, got these from Primarks. You can see there is only £6.50 for a pair of pyjamas. And they're like the cotton E-type material as well. Obviously, I don't know if they'll wear these or they have got some new Christmas pyjamas, which obviously they're wearing now. So, again, they've got the option there to wear their Christmas Eve pyjamas, their Christmas pyjamas or the ones I've got in their Christmas Eve box. I've got one of them. And again, Sammy's got exactly the same pair. But I've got Sammy the size large, that was all, because do find with Primark's clothes, they do always tend to be slightly smaller than what they say they are. And again, obviously the long suits, I hope, fingers crossed, if they are too big, it's something he could grow into. Got them a book each as well, because obviously Ben loves the touchy feely books. This is Never Touch an Elephant, if you can see it's got like all the little sentry things there. It's in the funny opposite book, if you look at it, you see you've got like a nice little word there. Obviously, essentially, thing here for the elephant. These were actually two for seven pound in Tesco's. So I've got the elephant one here, and then obviously for his birthday, I've got one about the snake. If you check out my Instagram, you'll see I did post a picture of Ben loving one of his um, sound books. He was absolutely loving that one. Believe it or not, we picked that from the charity shop last week. So they've got twenty p. It's one of his favourite books at the minute. Again, because he's going for a stage where he loves books. So again, it would be ideal for like your little toddlers. And stuff like that even if he kids have got sensory news like ben has because he really does love all this thing i've got me the poo jumper which slightly embossed up here every time i wear it ben touches it like this so i've got him that one sammy i've got him the christmas pine but it's done by julie donaldson and i know it's easy for him to read some people say probably outgrow it but she has which is probably any sort of words like this but sometimes with sammy if he's reading like a teenage book, sometimes even though he can actually read, because he can read really well, sometimes he doesn't understand the story or the plot line, so to speak. So, of course, we're getting him in this one here. At least I know he'll be able to tell me what it's about. Because, again, sometimes with like the teenage books and stuff he'll read, he'll say, oh, what's it about? Because I don't know, I just read it. So, at least he'll be able to see it's about a Christmas tree for him. They always have a DVD or Blu-ray to in their, in their um, boxes as well. Got Ben, Arthur Christmas. Again, we've watched, sat and watched this the other day on Sky Christmas and Ben was laughing and giggling at it. So we've got him that for his, him to watch as well. And then we've also got Sammy Smallfoot. Again, we watched this at the cinema and Sammy absolutely loved this one again. So again, hopefully fingers crossed they'll, they'll watch them for those. And then I've got them some little hot chocolate sets. These, are, I think these look so cute, don't they? There's only a pound one fifty from the range. I think they, is that for the range or B and M? I definitely know they weren't no more than 
um two pounds so these would be ideal ben absolutely loves hot chocolate yesterday when we was at warwick castle he had it with all the whipped cream and the marshmallows and it's quite funny he had his he's like all around his mouth all around here it was so cute to see you see the kids absolutely love those as well and they did check actually where he could have or not actually because the gluten yeah you can have those which is fine and then i've also got these for the boys each for their boxes they they need for only a pound from the range and i'm glad i got them now because they went in the other day they haven't got any at all so yeah so they've got like a little christmas eve um i'd say it's christmas eve it's like a little christmas tree and they'll fill with some little sweets they do hang on the tree i was there in our room do i put these on the tree as they are although the thing is with us with chocolate especially with ben if he knows there's chocolates on the tree he'll go hunting for them so again, I thought these would be ideal because then you can keep them as well and put a little wee for them for next year. So I probably will do actually for their advent boxes. Again, we them for their Christmas Eve box next year. So Ben's got like a little Christmas tree. Again, I do love the colours. It's really good. And then obviously got Sammy a little red star. And I thought obviously like for a pound, they'd be ideal as well. And then finally, Ben's got a big massive sling. It's not a massive sling. It's a slinky. Again, it was... Three pound got this from the works. It probably won't even last five minutes to be honest with you, but it's always nice to have that little something because obviously we're doing elf on the shelf again. And normally Christmas Eve, the elves bring the boys the presents saying thank you for looking after them or putting up with them the last few days, so the last couple of weeks. So, yes, I got that one for for Ben. And then obviously, Sammy absolutely loves bath bombs every yeah, time he has a bath he's like mummy can i have one of your bath bombs i thought it'd be nice to have his own this is a snowman it's frosty vanilla bath fizzler again this was only a pound from the range so again i'm glad i got this one i did because again went in there and they haven't got any left so yes that's the three things i've got obviously this is the boys box as well if you can see it very well did that one this is what actually my sister made as well again i'll leave all our details in the description below it's creations by becca j her instagram and also she's got her own youtube channel as well so she's gonna so she's gonna do a few crafts on there as well so i don't have, I don't have a clue how to start obviously it's just like a little crepe type thing i know some people do boxes don't they but we thought the, especially with ben with a crepe what easier for him so anyway yeah so if you do christmas eve boxes comment down below what you actually put in yours anyway i just want to say thanks for watching today don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in my next one bye everyone